Hey everybody, it's Diamond Grandma coming to you with an unboxing from New Craft Day. They contacted me and asked me if I would do an unboxing and review. And they sent me three items to unbox and review. I have the prices down that they are on their website. Um, I will provide links in the description box for the products that I have. So y'all need to go check them out. They are budget friendly because I check that out. I try to go and look at their prices to see if you can get paintings off of their site for a budget and they are budget friendly. I always watch the, uh, go and look at their site and everything before I agree to do anything because y'all know that I like budget friendly and I try to provide budget friendly companies for y'all to um, be able to go to and purchase budget um, canvases and budget friendly projects. So, let's get into it. I had to open it because when they send me these uh, products, they it's just in a plain envelope. It doesn't have a, has a return address on it, but it doesn't have the name of the company or anything like that on it. So I always have to open them sometimes to figure out who they're from. So I just went ahead, opened them and got them out of the plastic. They come in a bubble tube envelope, like everything else or, you know, like the other ones do, so. But anyway, this first one right here is a 30 by 40 and it just has a standard tool kit in it. But this is all you need when you start. I recommend if you are doing this for the first time to use what they give you. I would not purchase a bunch of diamond painting stuff to I figured out whether I liked it or not. And I thought this one was gorgeous. It is a church out in the middle of nowhere and it's got all this foliage fall foliage and stuff and i just think it's gorgeous it is around like i say it is a 30 by 40 and on their website it is uh 672 and it has 20 colors in it and it does have the dmc numbers on the legend stick is good on it this is what the thumbnail looks like, that it will look like. And this is some of the drill fill. I know y'all like to see the drill fill, so I'm going to show y'all some of the drill fill. This would be a good one to do that you wouldn't have to have a light pad. Now, the one that I'm working on now, I have to have a light pad on it because the back of it is real dark and it has some darker colors in it. But now this one, ones that are like this, I don't have to have my light pad because they're light enough that I can see with just a regular LED light, so. But these are the beads. I'm not gonna open them. I done told y'all when they're just the regular beads, they run off a machine. They don't look trashy. They do not have the DMC numbers or anything on the bag, so. And like I say, this one was 672. Now, this other one right here is what they call a bubble round. Some people call them bubble rounds, hybrids. Anyway, it's a special shape one. And I had told y'all that I was getting back into special shape, that I hadn't ordered very many special shapes. Well, since some of these companies have reached out to me, I have been getting special shaped ones. And I like special shape. I like to do them like in between projects of regular ones. Standard tool kit, the only difference is you've got your tweezers. And I just think he is so cute. Y'all know that if you've watched my channel long enough, y'all know that I like sunflowers. And I like bees and stuff. I just thought that he was just cute. And this one has 12 different shapes and sizes and colors on it. And it does have the DMC numbers on it. And this is what it's going to look like. So cute. And y'all look at this drill fill. It's a plain one too. You wouldn't have any issues with doing this without a light pad. Stick is good on it. And I'm getting to where I like these special shaped ones. 
any of the special shaped ones. It don't necessarily have to be what they call the bubble rounds. But I've gotten to where I really like the special shaped ones because it's kind of a break in between the regular ones that you know you do. I'm gonna open these beads for y'all to look at. The special shaped ones I always like to open because they have such, such pretty colors in them. Ooh, look at that purple. That purple is gorgeous. So pretty. Just, I mean, just gorgeous colors. But there he is. And he was uh, 807 on their website, which is a good price for special shape because y'all know special shapes are pricey. And I think 807's budget friendly for a special shape canvas. And this last thing I got, I have not seen anything like it before. And it was $7.93. And it is a hanger. And I have not seen this, anything like this before. And, um, I got it because y'all know I always like to bring y'all different things, you know, to look at or different projects to do. And I just thought it was just pretty. But it is a cross and it has a place for a hanger and it comes with a standard tool kit and the hanger part is in it. But I just want y'all to see and I just thought it was pretty. I've not seen the cross before. I've seen other hangers and projects that people have done, but I have not ever seen the cross. And I got it and I thought, oh, I want that so bad. So I got it because y'all know I like to show y'all different diamond craft projects and stuff. And I just thought it was just cute. And we're gonna look at these beads because it's got a lot of different colors in it. It's got some ABs in it. This one has ABs. It's got some pink and blue ABs in it. But look how pretty they are. What number is that? That's H. So they just sent me just two. I, that's one thing that bothers me when they just send you just enough because you never know when you might get a hold of one that's bad or whatever and you're just stuck with what they sent you. So, I wish they would do, you know, different when it comes to that and give you at least one extra instead of just what you need. But it is just like on one side. It's not on two. It's just on one side. And I just thought it was pretty and it was unusual and different because I have not seen the cross. So, but anyway, y'all need to go check out New Craft Day and I'll go through the prices again. This one right here, the cross hanger was $7.93. The gnome with the sunflowers was uh, $8.07. And the church with the regular drills, round drills, so 30 by 40, was uh, 672. But I just want to say thank you to New Craft Day for sending me these products for review. And I just want to say, if you like what you see, hit the like button. If you would like to subscribe to my channel, I would love to have you. And y'all get on y'all's uh, internet, web, uh, phones, computers, whatever, and go check out New Craft Day and check out what they have. They have a lot to pick from. It's always hard. When they contacted me, it was so hard to pick out what I wanted to do for review. And I just want to say thank you to them. And if you like what you see, like I say, hit the like button because it just helps me get on up in the videos to where people will see my unboxings and stuff. And it will help my channel. And I just want to say, if you would like to subscribe and be part of the Diamond Grandma family, I would love to have you. Just hit that subscription button. It will upload anytime I do a video so you will not miss one. And I hope to see y'all tomorrow.